So at the beginning of this video, I just want to say that I am kind of sick. I'm not like fully sick yet, but you can definitely hear it in my voice. And it's like starting to get bad, but it's not quite there. So I can still talk and make videos. But it was really bad this morning, actually, and I could barely talk, but it got better throughout the day. So just a warning before we actually get into this video that uh, if you hear my voice sounding kind of different, that's why. But here we go. So what I want to make a video on today is the new elixir that they just released into the crown shop. And this is the first time they've ever released an elixir like this because all the other ways that you could even get membership in Wizard 101 has been through their website. And the other ways have been through gift cards. So this is the first time they've added a way to buy membership with crowns. And they added a one month prepaid time elixir for 8,000 crowns. And you can gift this to other people, to other accounts. You can gift it to one of your other accounts if you have multiple accounts. And uh, you'll get one month prepaid time to uh, have member for that account. And it applies for the whole account. It doesn't just apply for a single character. If it was a single character, then obviously no one would buy this. That's not worth it. But what I'm guessing it does is it just gives you the exact same thing as if you bought the $10 membership off the website. And then it applies it to your account and you have it for one month, 30 days, whatever it is. Then you get all the benefits of a member and uh, it'll be on your account for that time period. So I was looking through the Twitter post and some people um, say this is a good thing. Some people say it should have been cheaper. And then um, a lot of people are kind of justifying the price of it by saying, oh, it's giftable. So that's why it's a little bit more expensive than what a member should be. Because to me, a membership, if I had to equate a wizard membership, to how many crowns it's worth. I would say it's 5,000 crowns because every time that you redeem a wizard $10 gift card from GameStop or whatever, Walmart, wherever you get it, it always says, do you want one month member or do you want 5K crowns? And even with the Kroger cards, it asks you, do you want two month member or do you want 10K crowns? So from the beginning of this game, whenever they came out with gift cards, it's always been 5K. I don't know why suddenly when they add it into the crown shop, they are upping it by 3,000 crowns and making it 8,000. That to me is kind of like, okay, this is this is pretty expensive. Like this is a lot more than what you think it should be, especially when in the past I know that memberships equal 5K crowns. That's kind of what they, you know, have been telling us with these gift cards saying, okay, 5K crowns or one month, which one do you want? That's what membership is equivalent to. So people are justifying this by saying, oh, it's giftable. So it can be a little bit more expensive because of that feature. But the thing is, membership has always been giftable. You could always gift membership by going on the website, clicking the gift certificates, buying that for $9.95 or $10 or whatever it is. And then you can use that code and send it to your friend and they can redeem membership. You know, you could gift wizard memberships, do a giveaway for wizard memberships by doing that. And you can purchase that gift certificate and then send the code, and then they have it. That's one month. So it's already been giftable in the past. Now it's giftable in-game, but I don't think that means that since it's giftable in-game, since it's through the crown job, it needs to be marked up by 3,000 crowns. So that to me is a little bit weird. Like for sure, they could have made this 5,000 if they wanted to make it equivalent. If they wanted to kind of add on that like crown shop tax or whatever, maybe make it like 5,500 crowns or 6,000 crowns. But 8,000 seems like a lot. So I did the math on this. And I have an Excel spreadsheet, which I'll put on the screen. And this shows the uh, the crowns bundles that they have available on the shop right now. The bottom two rows are when there is a sale. The 60 for 60 sale and the super crown sale, which is 120k uh, crowns for $100. So we have the crowns in the left column, the price to buy those crowns, and then how much it is for a membership with that crowns bundle purchased like basically how far do your crowns go in purchasing a membership for 8,000 crowns so i did the math on that to kind of give you an idea of how much um your membership will cost if you bought membership with that many crowns so for the first row you pay five dollars and you get 2,500 crowns for this one you have to buy that bundle four times in order to get 10,000 total crowns and then you spend those crowns, you spend 8,000 of those 10,000 on membership, and that comes out to be $16. So you just bought membership for $16 if you bought four $5 
um, crowns bundles, and then you went in and you bought this for 8,000 crowns. Obviously, that's not worth it. You could have saved a lot of money just by buying the membership off the website and not buying it through the crown shop. So it's not worth it to buy this if you buy the first two bundles because the first two bundles are basically the same thing. The other one is 5,000 for $10 and it works out to be the same exact math. So as you go up in the crowns bundles, the membership comes down a little bit. If you bought the 13,750 uh, crowns bundle, then it'll be like $14. The 30K crown bundle, it'll be $13, which still is, is more than membership normally is. Membership is only $10. If you're buying it through this way, you're losing money by doing that. Um, if you bought the 60,000 crowns for $80, then you are paying a little over $10 for membership if you bought it through the crown shop it's only equivalent if you buy the biggest crown bundle which is 80,000 crowns for a hundred dollars that's the only way that makes it equivalent it makes it exactly ten dollars and actually you're still losing five cents because membership on the website is 9.95 so i thought that was interesting even buying the biggest bundle of crowns that they offer you're still losing a little bit of money by purchasing this in the crown shop so then I went and I took the crown sales and I did the same math on those and calculated how much the membership would cost. And the 60 for 60, which is a really good sale that they run, is only $8 so that you're saving money, which is good. And then the other one is the super crown sale, 120,000 crowns for $100 and membership comes out to be like $6.67, something like that. So the only way this is worth it is if you buy it during the sale but that's true for anything your crowns are worth so much more if you buy it during the sale that's just you know how it's always been i hate buying crowns without the sales that's why i'm waiting it out for one of the sales to finally come out it's been a while and um, i got 5,000 crowns from the bundle that i posted yesterday but that's all i have usually i like to buy 60 for 60k uh, crowns because that's worth it to me but we just haven't seen a sale like that I don't know when it's going to come out. We haven't had one for a long time. And uh, I just feel like crowns are not worth it unless you buy it with those sales because you just get so much more out of your crowns. So the takeaway from the chart that I made and uh, everything I've said so far is basically don't buy this new elixir unless you bought your crowns during a sale. Because otherwise you would have been better off just buying the membership through the website for $9.95 or as a gift certificate to send to someone because otherwise it's not worth it it's definitely worth it if you buy it during a sale then you're saving but yeah i mean i understand the argument though where it's like oh well if you have crowns anyway and you want to gift it then this is a good way to do that which is true but i'm just saying that it's not worth it if you buy it like if you're just buying crowns normal price it's really not so i would avoid that if you can another thing i've seen people talking about is that since this is an elixir it will pause when you log off the game and the membership will only apply when you're on the game and playing. But I really don't think that's true because I was reading through the the website and even though I haven't tested this, I feel like what it does is it just adds that one month to your account because this isn't just character based. It has to be account based. That's how memberships work. And I think it just adds it to your account the 30 days time and that's it. I don't think that when you buy this, it's going to show up as like a real elixir like in the corner or not. I don't think it's going to do that because that doesn't really make any sense to have like a countdown for your membership because this needs to apply to all your characters in the account. So I think if you don't have a member and then you buy that, it'll make the upgrade now go away, I'm assuming, and you'll just have membership. And uh, you might have to like log out to get it to apply, but I think that's how it works. I don't think it's like a real elixir because, you know, that'd be sick though if you, if they made it like a real elixir, 8,000 crowns, and then when you log off, you're not using your time. You're not using your one month. And then when you log on, you are using it. If that was true, I would buy it and say, this is worth 8,000 crowns. But I really doubt that's how it works. I would have to test it to see, or maybe someone else can test it for me and tell me. I don't think that's how it works. That would be really awesome if that's how it worked. But I just feel like that's not true. Because I feel like it's on the website. You log onto your account. It'll tell you you have this much time. And then after that, your membership will end. I feel like that's how it works. But... I don't know. I, I just feel like they wouldn't do it like a real elixir, even though if they, okay, if they were to do that, I feel like they would make it more expensive than 8,000 crowns. They would make it a lot more than that, but that is going to do it for this video. I struggled my way through it with my voice. 
I really hope they don't get even more sick than this because I know there's some other videos that I want to make uh, this week and this month with the new October stuff. But if you guys enjoyed this video, if you made it through, if you struggled with me, then uh, please leave a like on it. Subscribe for more videos in the future. And I'll see you all next time.